This is what really bugs me about God. Well, one of the many, one of the long list of many things. <laughs> wow, you got an issue with God, God, man? Yeah. He's I got, got an issue with you, you now. Pick. God's always had an issue with me. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, I just feel that when people say, you don't, like, how could, how did the universe come from nothing? You know, how did the Big Bang, ha- Big Bang happen from nothing? One, I mean, you're, probably don't it's probably more complex than you think it is it's been simplified for you in school that was probably something they, before the big bang they teach they teach the big bang to children so maybe maybe mm. you're getting a children's explanation rather Ooh. than than a than a top level physicist explanation mm. but that's besides the point when they say how could something come from nothing the universe had to come from somewhere i think the universe came from god where the fuck did god come from huh <laughs> where's god coming from Where's who? who no, nah, he was. Al- nah, he and was then, always there. But that's it. Then they just make up a new rule where they're like, <laughs> "Well, yeah, um, God is all, all knowing and all being. He's and eternal, omnipotent, and yes. has always existed." You, you just you haven't solved the problem. You've changed the rules of the bloody game. But how well, does that like happen? A, it's a nice, it's a nice sort of mental trick to sort of fill in the scary gap. And that's fine. Yeah. And that's what, look. I I have no issue with people believing in God and you know not harming anyone else or whatever or indoctrinating kids or you know chopping bits off of them or anything like that that's all good with Mm. me if you want to believe in god go ahead you have my permission i give it to you yeah very kind to me Mm. um so (laughs) go ahead and believe in god but if you're gonna stand up to scientists and say pa your idea is stupid my idea works because you've made up the rules of your idea. We're, like scientists <laughs> are trying to play within the rules of the universe yeah. as they have observed them, yeah. and you're saying no. Actually, your explanation is dumb mm. because you've not made up your own rules, like I have. Yeah, my that explains God. everything. Yeah. <laughs> like this is why, obviously, religion is just a different lens uh, to, with uh, through which uh, one can view the world. Yeah. The reason that I often find it a less than favorable lens is that it tends to know everything. You know, does have an explanation for everything. Whereas science is always like, oh, we don't know this, and oh, we may be wrong about that. Religion often seems to just have has lots of answer. answers, but yeah, yeah, lots of rules, lots of answers, but no explanations. Yeah, yeah. The explanations often boil down to, well, because, but mm-hmm. that's the way just, it is. Just because that just is because. true. Yeah, that's it is it. true. That it yeah. is. It is because God. Yeah. Wait, so wait, why does why does God uh, why does why does God let kids get a uh, bone cancer and die? Oh, God, oh, works, God works in mysterious, mysterious ways. ways. Mm. Do you think you could understand God's mind? How dare you try and claim that you can understand God's grand plan? I mean, I guess I I I guess you have set up a situation wherein I have no retort mm. because you've se- they've essentially done that thing. Would you when you were, have you ever played like a game with a sibling or a friend when you were a kid and you're with one of those just little bastards that change the rules yeah. Yeah. And they right just, as they're about to lose, right oh, yeah. about to lose. Oh, my yeah. cousin does this all the time exactly i just stop it and you're just like hey, not fun to play with the cousin that i met at your wedding the adult cousin <laughs> no <laughs> yes <laughs> my <laughs> adult cousin <laughs> Anna, to this is, day <laughs> older than me <laughs> she does this just what? changes the rules That's in every so game weird. <laughs> no my little baby cousin <laughs> when we play table football she just goes ah Mm, no <laughs> and then changes something and then she wins Aww. and i go oh no i've lost Aww. see if that were to happen to me i'd be like hey kid it's not how the real world works you lost yeah. deal with it you know well life will teach her eventually yeah exactly yeah mm. or yeah. Oh, she's gonna learn or she'll become a tyrant <laughs> <laughs> one or of those two. a priest no. you know? <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> largely the same thing <laughs> it's a joke. Mm. It's just a little joke. Oof. It's just a little joke. Oh, I'm sorry. Are priests above reproach Oof. here? Oof. Are priests above repro- uh, reproach? Priests, priests are above reproach with a certain portion of the population who really like priests. <laughs> sure. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not a portion of that population. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Priest lovers love priests. So obviously, panspermia just does that kind of the whole sort of god problem, where it says, mm. "Ah, you have a problem." It's no longer a problem. This and actually the what they've answer. done is just swept it under yeah, the rug or yes. you know, pushed it off to the side and said, actually, no, the, the problem is someone else's problem to solve. Mm.